uh, enjoying itself in Hogan Creek uh, from last year. And some adults, the best way to think of them is, is as the teenagers. Um, there are some physical differences. They may be subtle for some folks, but uh, the ears in the subadult tend to be disproportionately large compared to the rest of the head, and they also appear to be kind of closer together. The head, neck, and shoulders, um, uh, the, the head's elongated and triangular shape. The neck appears to kind of be longer and thin. And the body and legs tend to be long and lanky. And then um, what we typically see in the park are these younger subadults and females either without cubs or females with cubs. And then females um, will typically have cubs anywhere from five to 10 years old. Uh, they're gonna hold on to those cubs for at least two and a half years, but we ha we've also had females that have held on to them, in rare cases, held on to them for as long as four and a half years.